Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Autonauts. We are gonna continue figuring out how these cows work. All right, we had one cow full up on milk, so we need to figure out milking as well as we need to get the grass planting going and get a full field of grass planting. It, I'll be very curious to see if once we have all this grass planted, if grass grows fast enough for both cows to eat it all as well as if there's any overage for us to then chop it down to get grass seed because we need grass seed what do we need grass seed again for there's something we need grass seed for oh what is it grass 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 we need grass seed for something oh is it hay bales cut grass goes into i want to say hay bales and we use hay bales for reproducing cows. Okay. And I guess that's it? And then I guess once we have cows, I guess we don't need to worry about chopping any more grass down because once we have the amount of cows we need, once we have 10 cows, we don't have to worry about it anymore. Okay, so let's look at milk. Milk is probably just a bucket. I'm guessing a bucket clicked on a cow. Milk, milk, milk. Crude bucket, yeah, plus a cow gives you milk, and milk goes into barrels. Oh, right. So let's get some barrels made. Uh-oh. Oh, saving. Of course. Of course. Let's get some barrels made up here. There we go. We got a bunch of fencing over there. And I think what we want to do is actually... Let's move all this. Let's get all this fencing. Let's just surround that whole area and fencing if we can. Oops. Give me this fence. That way our cows never disappear. I mean, luckily this isn't a game with like enemies or anything like that that are going to come kill the cows in the middle of the night. So I think the fencing is purely just to consider what cows have been penned versus what haven't been penned. But... It feels right just having them enclosed in a nice little grassy field. All right, so we are going to need some more fencing. And that is here. Let's just do a bunch of fencing. That's fine, because we're going to use it at some point, so it's not a big deal. And I should probably get... Where's my storage for turf at. I know I have it somewhere. Oh, here it is. Alright, that one's full. We got 71. You know what? Maybe we just go plant all this. Alright, I'll just fill all this in because I don't need all this dirt over here. Alright, and then we need to figure out what we do with dung. I'm guessing we turn that into fertilizer in some sort of process. Because I'm pretty sure we just don't pick it up and put it on tilled soil. Which will be great if we can figure that out, because then our output of things like cereal should increase by one. I think every single time, so right now it's a yield of three because it's tilled. I'm guessing fertilizer will take it to four and water should take it to five is my guess. Because without it being tilled, it's two and then with tilled is three. So it seems like it just goes up by one each time, but you know, that's a very, very short sample size to think that but i wouldn't think it's gonna do anything like double or triple just from fertilization and water it could but i don't think that game's gonna do that i think it would break a lot of things if watering watering and fertilizer all of a sudden yielded like 10 cereal that seems like way too much so my guess it just goes up one for each extra part that i get added to that all right so we're getting rid of all this turf and then once we do that, everything's dug up, so then we can just start planting grass, right? I think so. All right, so let's move this guy out here. And then we have some fences being made. All right. There's probably enough fence to actually finish it. It's probably like just enough. I think we only need... Oh, perfect. And then we got a gate. Nice. 
It's all fenced in. So let's take... Cut grass storage. So this is... Grass seed? So I should just be able to plant this. So question is... Actually, this isn't growing as fast as I thought it was before. And I think this robot is waiting to cut it down, but it's getting eaten too fast. All right, so maybe we take... We take you. Find nearest grass. Let's move you then. Since they're eating too fast. Let's move your area. I guess let's just go cut down this grass. And then we'll just manually take the seeds back. Go? Hello? Find nearest grass and area- What? It didn't save! Hello? Okay. And go. There we go. Okay, so let's start cutting all that down. We are gonna have- There we go. Barrows for milk. Perfect. So then we'll pop out cows right there. Milk is probably, I'm guessing, gonna be for like a tier four food, right? Because bread is tier three. We're still not making enough dough. Ugh. Although we weren't making dough because we ran out of seeds. And we're still running out of seeds? Oh. We are running out of seeds because we're not processing it fast enough. Okay. So who's taking it out of here? Who's taking it? So you're stacking it. Okay. And then there's one bot here stacking. So what's taking you so long to stack? Find near cereal. No, that's not you. Wait, so who's the stacker? It's you. Hey, come back. Grain straw collector, no. Cereal crop flailer, no. Or is it the flailer? Find near straw, move. Move to grain. No, it's not you. It might be the flailer. Where'd, where'd the flailer go again? Wait, why do I keep losing this flailer? Is he under here? He might be under there. Here, let's... Let's just go this way. I wish you could search this list. Cereal crop flailer. Okay, it's not you. Cereal crop retrieve. That's what it- Oh, wait, 20? No wonder. Okay, that's far too long of a wait. Let's do 10. I'm not- Oh, I did that because of- These were getting overflown- Overflowed. But since I have the deleters, I don't have to worry about that, I don't think. 10 seconds should do. I think everything gets collected fast enough that that shouldn't be an issue. There we go. They're picking it up right as we're starting to collect it. We might be able to increase this to like 11 or 12 seconds. But we should be good. Like it might slowly start to stack up. But that's definitely going to be way better. Um, Let's go get this grass seed down here and then we'll start planting all this and then we need to look at milk is easy it's just programming a bot with a bucket that's easy enough if anything we're probably going to want that bot whoever it is to have a speed upgrade and then we need to figure out what to do with the dung again it's probably fertilizer i f think i remember there being some sort of machine that handles that but we will see all right, let's check real quick. Fertilizer is a compost bin, which we don't have. Level three research waste technology, okay. And we're currently researching what? Crude transportation technology. Oh, it's not going because we are so, so behind on Cereal and grain. Okay, how do we increase that? 
You know what? I think we increase it by doubling this. I think we need another bot to plant. Or do we? Maybe we need another bot. Hmm. Planting's fine. Okay, we just don't have enough seed, I think, is all it is. So maybe I go to this cereal... The wheat... No, not the planter. It's not grain and straw, it's... Cereal. Where's the cereal collector? Cereal crop retriever, okay. Move to cereal storage three. Take... Oh no, you're just dropping on the floor. Soil hoer, cereal scyther. Who's actually collecting it? Are you not in a group? Cereal collector, here you go. Why are you not in a group? Cereal collector. So you are currently putting in... Find near cereal, move to cereal storage three. Okay, so that's going there. So then the, this is the bottleneck right here. It's not getting flailed fast enough? I guess that's the bottleneck? Or it's not getting collected fast enough? Green and straw collector. It seems fine. We might want to change this up. You know what? Let's change this up once he goes through the next thing. We'll see if we can program it that we get the storage for planting we'll see if we can get it so that fills up first before food so that way we always have stuff for replanting okay let's stop that okay repeat three times move to straw storage add three repeat three times you're finding the grain picking them all up move to grain storage three okay we want to ignore that part so until this is full, we are gonna move there and add to storage. If that ever gets full and we get stuck, we'll jump out of that loop and... Oh, and then we do if hands... Can we do until hands are not empty? Oh, until hands are empty. There we go. Move to that and that. So, okay, let's step through this. Let's see if this would work. So, straw, we can skip over. We're gonna find three grain, because that's how much drop at a time. Well, three grain drop here. That's what it is. We move to it. We pick up all three. And then we're immediately gonna go to this storage as long as it's not full. And then we're gonna move to it and add the store to it. So that should do it until our hands are empty, right? But then I th it might get stuck here. If we jump out of this loop, if this grain storage is ever full, like it gets stuck here, we'll jump out. And if our hands are not empty, as in they have something in our hands, we'll then move to this storage and add to it. And we can do it until hands empty. Okay, let's try that. Let's see if it gets stuck. I have a feeling it will, but this will at least have it so we have more seeds to plant. Because right now we're not filling out this little tiny five by five farm, which is not good. Okay, there's the straw, picking up three grain. Move, pick up. Okay, we're gonna go deposit three. Yeah, got stuck. All right, we could do one more loop in here somehow. So until hands are empty, will this work? Until hands are empty. Go there. Until green storage full. That might get stuck as well. We'll have to see. 
Okay, we'll just let it run through again. This is gonna pile up, which is fine for now. All right, do the straw. There we go. And this is the test. Okay, picking up three grain. Okay, move to storage. You're gonna put one in, do it again, do it again. And then we're stuck in there because storage is not full. I don't get why it doesn't get stuck here because we can't add, so it should pause here. Until, maybe we do until hands are empty? Oh, maybe we just do this. So we'll try to go to this storage and until hands are empty, we'll deposit. If we can't empty our hands, we'll exit to the next loop and we'll try to put into that. Trying to figure out this little arrow thing, like to escape out of a loop is a little confusing. I think I'm starting to understand it more and more. I could also speed things up by having them collect like six grain at a time. Okay, and three grain. Go deposit all three, and as long as it pops out, and we go to the next part, perfect. So that should be good. So the downside is, this is gonna wait till we have 400 grain, which is gonna take a bit. Although maybe I, here, let's do this. Since we don't wanna wait for 400 grain. Oh, we can't, cause there's stuff in it. I was gonna say, can we take that off? I wish we could take this off and make it like a storage for 100. That'd be way quicker. So this is the collector. No, it's not the collector. It is the grain straw collector. Okay, so that's working through. We could help. We could help a bit. One, two, three. Just to get this tower gone. Oh my God, the tower's getting bigger. You know what we can also do? The retriever. Let's, let's edit your wait time to like 12 seconds. That'll help even that out a bit. Um, That's fine if that's there. Let's go get the rest of this grass and plant it. Yeah, so we're not doing any research because we have no... We're not really making bread at this point. Because we are really low on cereal, but we're low on cereal because we're not even planting fast enough. So we will hopefully get that evened out here. In just a little bit. Wait, what was that? Colonization? Oh yeah. Starting to get more. Starting to get more. Alright. All right, plant all this grass. Oh yeah, I forgot this grass will grow in the middle of the night and then we can use those seeds to replant. So here, take this guy. Oh yeah, of course I can't reprogram if I'm currently moving. So let's move your search area. Put it back up here and go. Beautiful. Let's go get this grass so we don't forget this. Alright, let's go. So much snow. So he should be able to cut down this grass as it grows in the middle of the night, and then that grass will be used to reseed. I forgot that was also our plan. Actually, do we have a grass collector? We do. Collector and a planter right there. I don't know if these cows eat cut grass that's sitting on the floor. They might. Because I feel like this didn't expand at all in the last nighttime cycle. So maybe they eat the cut grass as well. Okay, we might be able to get away with another... Cereal whacker. Or like a cereal scyther. Okay, we're getting all the cereal here. Okay, one more trip ought to do it. There we go. So middle of night. We're cutting down the grass. 
Wait, whoa, whoa. Oh! I totally forgot. Cutting grass? Oh, they do eat the cut grass. Okay. Cutting grass... ...also gets rid of it. It doesn't just... ...like, minimize it how it does when they eat it. So you do have to replant. Unfortunately. Oh, it's because we didn't replant that last piece of grass. Dang it. So this is not good. What's happening is we're cutting this down and then the cows are eating it before we could pick it up. That's why we're running out of grass here. So now it's not regenerating because once we cut it down, they're eating it before the collector can pick it up and go replant it. That is not good. That is not good. Did they just do a backflip? Do they poo by doing backflips? What? That's a... It's an odd technique. Alright, how's the cereal coming? We got 13, that's it. Oh, full on milk. Okay. Well, while you're full on milk, let's program... Milker! You're the milker! We need a bucket. Although last time, the cow... That went away, so I think after a little bit, the milk need just goes away. So hopefully we can get there in time. Alright, and then we left click you. Move to full cow. Go! Go, 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 go! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Beautiful! Alright, and then we deposit. Beautiful! Forever and then until hands are empty Find cow in this area Move to the cow use your bucket move to milk storage three add milk storage three If your bucket breaks go get a new bucket cool And there you go you got my bucket go milk cows if you need to yeah, they do they do backflips by Pooping. All right. All right. See, the issue is if I cut this down, or if I have this him cut this down, they're gonna eat it, because the collector is gonna be way too slow. No, it's mine. So I think we need a separate plot of grass for planting. Oh my God, they are eating so fast. How do I store dung? Okay, in a container. Let's get a bot to start collecting this as well. Dung collector! And you got the super simple job just picking up poop all day. Although it probably pays pretty well. The nastier the job, the more it tends to pay apparently. There you go. And, oh, 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 let's make sure we do the, you know what, no, that's fine, because if this gets full, we'll just add a deleter. So that should be good. We're, s oh, wow, grain is going very, very slow. Hmm. <laughs> oh, we are just at a st Dan still. What else can we do for level 3 food? We need food. We need food. Pumpkin soup. Okay, let's look at apples, because apples we get really easily. Spiced apples. Okay, we can do that with weeds. And I think we have a ton of weeds, do we not? Yeah, we do. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Spiced apples, so that's easy enough to make. Then we take two spiced apples, plus fresh water, plus a plot, pot. Okay, and how's our water situation? It's pretty slow, so we might need a couple bots running water. So what are these guys doing? Spiced apple chef. Oh, we still have these chefs! Do we just leave them? Wait, where, where's our fourth one? 
Spiced Apple Chef. Chef, Spiced Apple Chef 1 and 2. Oh, they're waiting. Why are you waiting? Wait, why are you wait? Oh, it's because I stopped you. Wait, so... That needs to go there. Obviously. Alright, so that's gonna make spiced apples. Ooh. And then what we can do... Here, this'll help. This'll help. Let's do... So, what do we need? Water and clay pots. Plus a crude mixing pot. Where's that at? Crude mixing pot. Oh, it's one of those again. Ooh, so what we can do, we'll switch this over from spiced berries. Or, because it's probably the same exact recipe for berries, is it not? It is. Ooh, that's what we're going to do. Let's break this up, shall we? So let's do, let's copy this. We'll make two more bowls. So let's go make this. So the idea is these chefs are just going to keep on pumping out spiced apples and spiced berries. Then we're going to get two new bots that are going to convert those into the stewed apple and stewed berries. And then we'll help, like we'll break that up. Like maybe we'll leave four of these babies eating bread. And then we'll make like three making eating the spiced berries and three eating the stewed apples. That should help break up all the food they're waiting for, so they're not all waiting for the same thing like they are now, and absolutely no love is being made. Alright. So let's get two mixing pots. We're gonna need two bots as well. Alright, alright, alright. And then, I think this is all we need. I think it's just a matter of programming now. Let's just go move these down. Um, let's move it. Sure, we'll just move it here. Whatever, we'll move it there. That's fine. Um, okay, since we stopped all these spice chefs, we need to finish whatever they're currently working on. Otherwise, the recipe is going to kind of mess up. So let's take this out of your hand. Oh, you don't have anything in your hands. Wait, you have weeds in your hand. Oh, must have clicked the wrong one. There we go. We'll make that. So that'll clear that out. So you can resume your duties. And you, you're waiting on one weed. So let's go get a weed. And it looks like they're going left to right. Wait, are they? No, they're going right to left. Okay, we'll get this done. Spiced apples, that's fine. So that bot, we can just continue. And this bot is... We got four apples. So let's get that cleared up. Oh, and since that didn't start, we can just... Throw these on the ground, shall we? We'll throw this in here. And we will get these chefs. You can all resume your duties. Perfect. Now you, sir, are a... What is it? Stewed berry maker? And what do you need to do? You need to take... Two of these. Oh, let's stop this. We need to set the recipe. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, we need to upgrade it. Oh. How do we upgrade? Four clay, a stick, and a torch. Okay. Well, let's do the old cheaty cheaty and just drag it over to the clay. Instead of walking back and forth. Yeah, we got so many berries and stuff. So now I guess I see why you end up diversifying your food. Because if you bottleneck with... Trying to make one type of food. Could really put a hamper on doing research. Alright, then let's move it up here by sticks. And we need two torches. 
I'm not even sure what it costs to make torches. I want to say it was like, what, straw on a stick or something? How many sticks is it? Four each. All right, and then... Now let's see, what's a torch? What's a torch? Straw on a stick, nice, nailed it. So let's go get a bunch of straw. Oh my God, this is piling high. I think we're slowly working through it though. I think we're slowly working through that. All right, make these two torches. I didn't realize these mixing bowls had an upgrade. I did not realize that. All right, let's add to that. Here's a crude torch. And let's make one more. You know what, cereal's probably fine. It looks like we're a little behind, but I think if we get into the realm of, like getting another scyther, I think we'll start chopping it down too quick. And then it's like, okay, well now we're chopping it down too quick. So now we need to plant more. And I think we'll just be in like a loop of like constantly trying to balance things out. So I think we're better out probably just leaving it until everything catches up. All right, better mixing pots. Perfect, perfect, perfect. All right, let's put those there, set these recipes. And then did I take a bot already? I did, stewed berry maker. So you are making stewed berries and we'll switch this one while we're at it. Stewed berries, so I need stewed berry maker. Okay, watch me. Okay, we need to delete this, you don't need that. So you're adding these two, you're gonna take a clay pot. Oh, we gotta do the water thing again. Okay, okay, we need the water, so we need a bucket. Right, we do need a bucket to get the water. We can't use our hands. And boom, got a bucket. Oh, we're gonna need a memory upgrade, aren't we? Yeah, boy. Goo, goo, goo. Oh, no, we clicked on the wrong thing. Go over here. Okay, take from the barrel. Add it there. Okay, so move to spice berries. We're taking two. Move to crude pot. Add, add. So if we delete that. Get clay pot. Add it. Get a crude bucket. Add fresh water, move and add. Okay, so that we can cut out again. Okay, so that's redundant. And, oh my God, it needs fuel? Oh. All right, let's loop that. Now, how did I do the these guys. I did until hands full until ha okay so I did a double until hands full retrieve stow and I'm pretty sure these guys need a brain upgrade oh my god so we need to do a brain upgrade on this guy as well as we need a fuel man for both of these I think we have to split up fuel just because we're spending too much time waiting right or did I figure it out with the other fuel guy? Oh yeah, that's what we did. We just did the little down arrow. So that should be fine. That should be fine. All right, that's a lot to do. And this is kind of going on a little long. So I will handle that on the next episode and we will fully get some stewed berries and stewed apples going so that way we can feed these dang colonists who are probably starving to death and then hopefully while we're working on that this grain storage starts to slowly build up we are running out of grass all right why are we running out of grass it's because of the wait where'd our bot go it's this guy 
He's cutting it down and then they're just eating it all. So we need to not cut down for the time being. I'd rather have the cows just be able to eat and be happy. Otherwise, we're going to run out of grass and that's not good either. So yeah, we will handle all that on the next episode. So until then, take it easy, everyone.